Hi there, Ujimans. I'm Professor Boba, and I'll be hosting this episode of the Ujima Deep Dive. Today, I'll talk about the ability Tinted Lens. Pokemon in Sword and Shield with Tinted Lens are Butterfree, Noctowl, and Sigilyph. Right now, Ujima will be giving away our Tinted Lens pack for the next 72 hours using the code 1002-1002. Again, that's code 1002-1002. Be sure to get these battle-ready mon while you can. So let's talk about Tinted Lens. What does it do? The ability Tinted Lens doubles the damage done by not very effective moves. First, let's explore move effectiveness using some in-game battle footage. Whether or not a move is considered effective is determined by the type of move being used and the type of Pokemon it's being used against. If you've faced a Pokemon before, then the effectiveness will be shown underneath the move, but I'll explain type effectiveness in more detail. For this example, we have Umbreon, which is a dark type Pokemon. On the other side, we have two Sigilyph, which have access to a wide variety of different types of moves. First, we have Air Slash, which is a flying type move that is effective against dark types and does normal damage. Next, we have Dazzling Gleam, a fairy type move that's super effective against dark types and hits twice as hard. It also has Dark Pulse. Now, as a Dark type move, it's not very effective against Dark type Pokemon. It's only going to deal half the damage. But this is where Tinted Lens comes into play. Here we have two Sigilyph, one with the ability Magic Guard and one with Tinted Lens. This way we can see what happens when both of these Pokemon use the exact same type of moves against Umbreon. First, we have the Sigilyph without Tinted Lens using Dark Pulse, which is not very effective against Umbreon. As you can see, the move is not very effective and doesn't do very much damage to Umbreon. But what happens when we have a Sigilyph with Tinted Lens using the exact same move? Now this Sigilyph does twice as much damage even though it's using the same move, and that's because of the Tinted Lens ability. Now it's important to remember that Tinted Lens only applies to moves that are not very effective. So let's see what happens when both Sigilyph use Air Slash, a move with normal effectiveness against Umbreon. As you can see, both Sigilyph do the same amount of damage. Well, what about a super effective move like Dazzling Gleam? Again, we get the same amount of damage from both Sigilyph. And last but not least, what about a psychic type move that normally has no effect on dark types? Sure enough, even with the tinted lens ability, the move deals no damage. So let's recap. Tinted Lens is an ability that doubles the damage done by not very effective moves. Moves that are effective, super effective, or have no effect at all aren't affected by Tinted Lens. The Tinted Lens ability can be really helpful in battles, making more stab moves viable against a wider range of Pokemon. I hope you all enjoyed this deep dive on the Tinted Lens ability. Be sure to snatch up these battle ready mon in our Ujima Tinted Lens pack using the code 1002-1002. Again, that's code 1002-1002. You only have 72 hours. If you want to see breakdowns of abilities or moves, comment your ideas below. 
Again, I'm Professor Boba, and I hope to see you all next time on Ujima Deep Dive.